So here I want to show you connecting the Neo 3 to both a computer and a projector at the same time. You might ask, why would you want to do this? Well, if you're in a situation where you just want to plug directly into a projector and present that way, yet still record and do things on your computer during your presentation, this is a great way to do that. And you don't have to worry about connecting your computer into an existing system with a TV or projector. So here's how this is going to work. Uh, again, we have our power supply, again supplied with the hover cam. I'm going to plug that in. You'll have your USB cable, again comes in the box with the hover cam. Plug that in here, right in the back. And then we're going to feed that over to a USB port in our laptop. And you don't need a laptop specifically, this will work just fine with a desktop or any other computer, PC or Mac. So now we have that connected. Lastly, we still have our projector here. We're going to just plug in the VGA port and we'll be all set. Again, we need to turn the camera on. We have the power button in the back. The blue lights are now on, so we are powered and up and running. Alright, so we have all our connections set. Now we're just going to open up the Hovercam Flex software on our computer. And we have a few options in the software. For our purposes here, we're going to go to video. I'm going to open the camera up. As you can see, we are now projecting the image through our projector. The software is automatically selecting the laptop's camera, so we need to change that. And there we go. Now we have a live image on both the projector as well as the computer. This is different than how you would do it with T3 because the T3 you would output the image from the computer to the projector. Here we're simultaneously outputting to both the computer and the projector. So, you know, we have the same image and if we actually lower our resolution to 720p, you can get a true 30 frames per second with this camera. That is a vast improvement over the Hovercam T3. So you get real-time video with, the, uh, with 720p resolution. Uh, you can up it to 1600 by 1200, which is true HD, actually above that. Uh, it's down to about 20 frames per second, so it's a little bit slower, but you get a lot of great detail out of there. So what can we do in this situation? Well, as I mentioned before, we're connected directly into this projector. So if you have an existing setup, you can plug right into it and project that way using the buttons on your camera. So we, get, we just froze the image on the projector, but on our laptop, it's not frozen. This is still live on our laptop. We can do some work on it that way without having anything pop up on the projector. We can unfreeze it and we're back there. Uh, we can also use our laptop to record or capture images without having any of that stuff show up on the projected image that the audience is seeing because that's all going right through the projector. And you can even split your resolutions if you want to have a higher resolution going to the projector, lower resolution on your computer for some reason, you can do that as well. Uh, but again, the, the really cool thing about this camera is the higher a video frame rate in 30 frames per second true motion video at 720p resolution. That is outstanding for a camera at this price point of $299. Using the second camera in the Neo 3, this little flip down camera here, you can actually record picture in picture video onto your computer but project video from here through the projector. So if you're presenting in front of an audience they'll be looking at the projected image from your projector. Meanwhile, your computer is going to have the same picture plus you as the presenter in the corner. And you can actually record that for later use or to send to someone who isn't present at your presentation. So that's a, a great tool that you can use only with the Neo 3 because you have both cameras on here and the ability to connect simultaneously to both a computer and a projector.